All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chupacabra Tutorials channel. I'm your host, Larry, and today I'm going to show you how to add friends, find friends, and all that jazz, including removing them and that sort of thing on the Xbox desktop app. So by default now, in the new layout for the app, your friends list is in the lower right-hand corner, and you can also click on this little button here to pop it out into its own little free-floating window. When you want to find somebody to add as a friend, you can go up here to the search bar and like, let's say you know that your friend really likes Persona, so we can type in Persona. Let's just say that like, Persona 76 is your friend, Billy. And if you were to go and open this person's profile, you can verify that they play the same games that you know Billy plays, and then you can add them as a friend. Now, if you add somebody as a friend and they don't add you back, it gets added to somebody's following list where it's one way ticket. Uh, you're following them, but they're not acknowledging you back. If they acknowledge you back, you'll be a friend and so on and so forth. And that's how you kind of find people to add them as a friend. You can also right click them in this menu and add friend as well. You can also invite them to a party or just follow them the regular way without asking to be their friend. You can also report them and block them and mute them if you were in like a game with them a few minutes ago and you know they're an a-hole and you're gonna get match with them again so you don't have to listen to them. Uh, if you wanna add more friends than that, you can click on this little button here that says find more friends. So what this is, is this is the list of people that you recently played a game with. So, you know, this is probably for people I played Sea of Thieves with. Uh, because I played with them in a random match, it shows up here on my recent list, and I could say, oh, you know, Flashpoint was a pretty cool dude. I can click that and then add him as a friend, or at least request to add him as a friend. Alternatively, I can add my Steam account to my Xbox account, and it'll look at people on my list and see which of them have also added uh, Xbox to their Steam account and then put two and two together and automatically add us as friends. I don't like to do that, but it's there if you want it. Uh, if you find some, if you've decided that you don't want somebody as a friend anymore, like let's just grab someone random from uh, this list of people that I have in my friends list. Like I don't really know who Gnarly Laughs is anymore, so I can open profile, and then I can go to more, and then I can remove them as a friend if I wanted to. Uh, this is also the same place where you could add them as a favorite, and that will make them appear at the very top of your menu here, like above everybody else. So like, you know, you got your girlfriend, your boyfriend, your bestie Steve, whoever, you can add them to the top so it's easier to find them and quickly click on them to invite them to a party or to a game and all that jazz. And it's relatively simple. Um, it's just they moved stuff around since I last made a tutorial about this, and it's a little obnoxious as a result. If you want to send someone a message in this list of people, you just double click on them. Well, it used to be you just double click on them. There it goes. Uh, and then you can send them a message. If you don't send them a message and you accidentally click on this, it's not going to spam them with like a pop-up message saying that weirdo Larry that you're friends with is trying to send you a message but didn't. Um, until you actually type something out and send it, nothing will be received. And uh, yeah, that's it for this one, ladies and gentlemen. This has been a brief look at how to find and add friends on your uh, Xbox. If you have received a friend request, it'll show up in your notifications window up here with all this other nonsense that is trying to advertise me to play. Uh, and then you can say yes or no or ignore the person or block them if you find that somebody's been spamming you with friend requests. That's something that I've seen random children do on the Xbox app before is just spam with someone to annoy the shit out of them with friend requests. You can block them and it stops that. So that'll be it for this one. Hope you found this helpful. I've been your host, Larry. This has been the updated version of how to find, add, and remove friends on the Xbox desktop app. Bye.